Hi guys. So I thought we would take a little break from the Hunger Games inspired tutorials. Um, because Valentine's Day is just right around the corner. It is less than a week away. So, yeah. Um, so this look is completely using 100% drugstore products, um, which a lot of my looks are. The palette I am using is the Wet n Wild, Wet, bleh, Wet n Wild Color Icon um, palette and Petal Pusher. It's just all these really pretty purple toned, jewel toned shades. Um, and I am primarily working with this side right here with the smokier side to create this look. Um, let me just swatch a few of these. I've had this palette for a while and I saw it the other day sitting in my drawer and I thought it just looked perfect for Valentine's Day. I especially love this um, pink iridescent shade right here. So I think it's just gorgeous. Um, so yeah. If you like this look, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. And if you want to know how to get this look, let's get started. Alright, so to begin, I'm going to take the NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk. I'm just going to put this on my lid. I don't want to go any higher than the crease. I'm just going to blend that out just a little bit. Now I am using... A brush for this I put some on the back of my hand just to get some build up and then I picked it up with the brush I messed up my pencil somehow um, when I sharpened it it got all jacked up so yeah next I'm going to take this purple this really pretty 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 purple shade um, it's got flecks of I believe copper glitter in it and I'm just going to pat that onto the base. You don't want to go sweeping it on because then it will it won't give you the proper color payoff. And plus you don't want to get those little flecks of glitter underneath your eyes. I'm just going to keep applying this until I get the right payoff. Next I'm going to take this dark plum. Now I'm just adding this little by little just going into the outer corner and then into the crease slightly with a pencil brush. Um, I don't want this to overpower the look. I'm just going to go in little by little and blend it out until it looks perfect. This is a lot of blending. Next I'm going to go in with this black with some purple, I believe it has purple glitter in it. And with a pencil brush I'm just going to put this in the outer V just to define the eye. And I'm going to blend that out again. Next I'm going to go in with this light pinky white and highlight my brow bone, my inner corner and the inner corner of my lower lash line. and I got a or a brush bristle in my eye. Next I'm going to line my waterline and tightline with my favorite eyeliner.
And then I'm going to line my upper lash line and wing out with my favorite liquid liner. Next, with a damp flat liner brush, I'm going to take that first color that we used and apply that to my lower lash line all the way across. And then I'm going to apply that second color to the outer half. And then I'm going to apply a really light shimmery pink to my to the inner quarter as well as the middle of my lid. Then I'm going to go back over with that first color just to blend a little bit. Next, I'm going to take my Rimmel London Lip Pencil in Nude. I'm just going to line my lips and fill them in. Alright, we're going to see if I can get this next part right because I always manage to mess up the name. Next, I'm going in with the Revlon Color Burst Lip Lacquer in Demure. I got it. I'm just going to go over that lip pencil. Now, the lip lacquer is more of a um, pinky nude and the lip pencil is more of just like a brownish nude. So this really, I like the combination that these two give. Next I'm going to curl my lashes and apply my favorite mascara at the moment. I know this one, yes this one is my favorite, the CoverGirl um, Bombshell Volume Mascara. Too long. All right, I'm just going to go over that with my liquid liner just to do any touch ups. And that is the completed look. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave me a comment down below. Um, and you can click on either one of the videos to see my last video. Bye. Happy Valentine's Day, guys.